Let me check. Seems like we're still on... Trucks out! Everybody brace yourself! <laughs> Rough ride! Man, the track is a complete wreck. Yeah! What's up with... One person I know fights like that. You are the real Jesse! Ivor! <clears throat> yes! It is I, your friend Ivor. I'm gonna need you now, Jesse! What? Yeah, what? It all started when I fell through a portal into some sort of strange world. Everything was all white. Master Shadow's domain. He claimed he was a... Nice. Huh, you see? Ninja reflexes. Wait, you tried to hit me. Why'd you try to hit me? That would have been quite painful. Wow. Master Shadow teach you how to whine, too? Uh, sorry, Ivor. Just something about your face makes me think... Punchy thoughts? Don't worry. People tell me the same thing. I, uh... I see. But seriously, what are you doing down here? Uh, right! Let me explain. You see, it all started when Harper and I returned from our vacation. We discovered that while we were gone, you had mysteriously vanished after fighting a prismarine giant named the Admin. Right. Only to return, having defeated this Admin and taken his amazing powers. Wait. What? Yeah, that's not right. Ugh, that is such a lie. Just thinking about the admin running around pretending to be me makes me sick. Yes, I would be frustrated too. Especially seeing how convincing the admin's disguise is. Jesse, aka the admin, gave me this and told me he had reprogrammed it to find the fraud, aka you. But with my new ninja senses, <clears throat> I could tell something wasn't right. Anyone who disagrees, anyone who questions Jesse, disappears. They must hate me. It's certainly not helping your reputation. No, but I knew that Jesse, the real Jesse, would never act like that. That's why I decided to try and use this opportunity to discover the truth. Luckily, it worked out, because I would have felt terrible about killing you. Classic thing to say to your friends. I can tell you're being sarcastic, but you'd be surprised. Ivor, even coming from you, that is one dumb plan. Yep. Oh, give me a break, would you? The admin has made everything very confusing. I'm a desperate man. Speaking of whom, I can't spend much more time down here. If I don't get back to the prison soon and report in, the admin will know that something isn't right. That's perfect. You can make up a lie and he'll never suspect that I'm actually down here. Which will buy you the time you need to find Fred's weapon. Hold on! How'd you know about I'm that? I'm a ninja. Anyway, that plan is all well and good. But what exactly should I tell the admin? It needs to be plausible. But dramatic. Yeah, believable, but entertaining. Okay, tell him that I escaped, but that you tracked me down and took me out. Yes, I'm sure he'll be delighted by the description of our epic confrontation. Your final 
desperate struggles to cling to a fading reality. You're a real poet, Ivor. Ninja! I'm sorry I can't stay longer, but I must go. Go. We'll see you when we get back to the surface. Oh, wait! Can I borrow that amulet? Certainly, but why? Long story involving a portal and a magic frame, but it'll help us get home. Please hurry. It's getting dire up there. Smoke bomb! <laughs> You saw nothing. We all just saw that, right? I, I didn't like hallucinate Ninja Ivor. Nah. -uh. Just when I thought that crusty dude couldn't get any weirder. And we're ready to roll. Come on, guys. Pointing right to that building. Oh, good. It only sounds like there are a few thousand big scary people between us and there. Halt! You there! What business have you? I, um, think we need to go into that building behind you. If that's okay! Uh, you know, it is in fact not okay, okay? Now just move along and don't go anywhere near the building or we will sick our army on you. Or we'll sick our army on you. Wouldn't want to unleash the force of our army. And it's a mighty army. Mightiest army I know. I fought creepers, zombies, a giant computer, a wither storm. Bring out your army. We can take it. You are not leaving. Oh, you will regret not leaving after you've tasted the wrath of our... Mighty army! Uh, that's weird! It's not weird! The army just, just, uh, took a power nap! Now they're stronger than ever, yeah! <laughs> Thanks to their nap, yeah. We're not gonna ask you again, all right? You just skedaddle before our well-rested army makes you regret it. We're gearing up. Yeah, it's the biggest army you've ever heard right here. Please, please, please don't send your army on us. Oh, please, please, we want to live. Listen, it's not a real army. It's just a jukebox recording, okay? Please, stop crying. We're not going to hurt you, but we can't let you in. Really, it's for your own good. That building you're pointing at? That's Romeo's challenge. Yeah, it's nothing more than a death trap. The worst kind of trap. Which is why we vowed to keep everyone out. Even relentless travelers like you. I mean, you should thank us for keeping you away from it, okay? We're doing you a solid. Yeah, duh. Thank you, Val and Sue, for doing us a solid. Fine by me. We'll just wait until you change your minds. Waiting. And waiting. And waiting. You know, if we were let into the challenge room, we'd probably be done with it already. We'd be away and out of your hair, and I wouldn't still be talking. Okay, okay fine. Just stop. Open the gate! On it! No, Soup. The, the gate. Yeah, the, the real gate. Right! On it! Whoa, weird llama. She must smell Luna on you. Wasteland. Yeah, uh, having a town where everyone enters a mysterious challenge room that never comes out will do that. I, uh, 
suppose that uh might affect population levels a little. Uh, we still don't feel good about permitting you in the challenge room, especially unarmed. But we'll trade you some gear if you can build something to scare off future unwanted visitors. You know, like a snowman or a huge flower. Just <sighs> make something that will help us strike fear into the hearts of all who would see it. Keep people off our backs. Something to give us a little me time. will give me nightmares. <laughs> well done. Yes. Wonderfully horrifying. Nothing organized, not alphabetized, not even sorted by material. This is barbaric. This is what we managed to salvage from the goofballs. Uh, I mean residents who tried entering. Armor, such fine quality. You just want to crouch in you. Please don't hit me. You know, like one trillion out of ten. Yeah. Waterfalls upstairs. It's so calculated, so precise. Judging by the multiple pressure plates, there's some complex engineering behind these walls. Wouldn't expect anything less from the guy who made an icy palace of despair. I think this was meant for the three friends Romeo, Zara, and Fred. How do you guys feel about pulling some mystery levers and seeing what happens? Designed all this just for his friends? Are you ready for the most brilliant, death-defying, heart-pounding challenge you've ever experienced? <laughs> Don't look friendly. At least it's 
it's not another dumb spider puzzle. Ooh! Wow! What a showdown, folks! We're having the time of our lives, aren't we? Water turns lava into cobblestone. Congratulations, challenges! Stage one of 600 <laughs> complete! What?